from Holly Barbs and today I'm going to be unboxing and testing out the Black & Decker Aura Cordless Vac. I'm really looking forward to trying this one out because um, Vacs are generally really heavy for me so I've been really looking forward to getting a cordless vac for ages. So I'm hoping that this is something we can use on up and down the stairs, to do skirting boards, to do the car and to do those little awkward areas that you can really struggle to get to with a vac that's plugged in. So I thought I'd start off by unboxing it and seeing what comes in the packaging. So you get the head of the vac, nicely wrapped up, protected, the instruction manual, um, a little foam disc, not quite sure what that's for. A little attachment brush. This must be the bit that hangs on the wall that you plug in so you can put it on and charge it. So this is the main unit, again all wrapped up. And finally the extension bit so you can push those down the right areas. Build it. Okay, so this end goes into here. So you push this down, push that inside, until it clicks. On the other end again, you push this down, push it in, until it clicks together. And there you have the full vac put together. So to empty the vac, you go to this side, and there's a plastic bit that sticks out here. So you pull that, tip it into the bin, and all the bits come. Out. You just close that, and there is also a section here that tells you the max, so how full it can get before it's too full. Now on the other side there is a little grey slide, slide that across, and this bit comes out, and this is how you get to clean the film. Oh 